hi everyone welcome to keto blogging and in this video i will show you how you can add a star rating schema in your wordpress website so as you can see in this post there is a star rating like this and user can easily rate this post according to their choice and if you rate it like this and you can it will ask you to follow you on social media or share this post and you can also take feedback from your visitors if they give you one star rating so you can basically use this as a feedback tool and improve your blog post and you can also show a star ratings like this so let me show you sometimes you will see an option like this star ratings so you can also implement the star rating schema in your wordpress website so let's check how you can implement this star rating system in your wordpress website and here in this video i will use two plugins and i will give you a review about this plugin so the first plugin is rate my post wp rating system so let's install this plugin and check how you can implement it in your wordpress website so for this you will need to go to your wordpress dashboard and go to plugins and let's click on add new and i will search for rate my post now let's install this plugin and by the way if you found this content helpful then make sure to hit the like button so let me just activate this plugin first okay the star rating plugin is installed and as you can see there is a option called rate my post so just click on here and here you can see this option star rating thumbs up hearts smileys so we will go for star rating here and i will click on add rating wizard to all post so it will add the star rating wizard after at the end of the blog post now you can also add result wizards to all post or you can also send me email whenever someone posted a star rating so i will not do that i will enable the prevent accidental votes here and i will select with structured data so you can select type of structured data for rich snippets so in case i am selecting it as product or you can select if you are re reviewing about movie then you can also implement movie schema or if you are reviewing books then you can also select book course like that so let me just select it as product and if you don't want to implement the star rating in particular post then you can also add that post id here so that it will exclude that post in star rating and you can click on read more to know more how to get the post id and add it here now let's click on show feedback wizards if rating is negative so if someone give you one star rating then it will ask you some feedback or it will ask the visitors to give some feedback why they give you one star in that post and you can also enable show social wizards if rating is positive so if they give you five star then it will show you social wizards so it will ask encourage user to follow you on social media links so you can add your facebook twitter links like that so let me just add my youtube channel link here and i will insert it here now let me just add the linkedin so let's so there is twitter available so let me just add the twitter here and that's it now let's it's asking to add rating wizard automatically to custom post type if you want to add this custom post type then you can do that and you can also enable for archive pages and you can also support multilingual website compatibility and if you don't want to use this plugin then you can see enable this option so that once you uninstall this plugin it will delete all the data from your database so let's click on save settings okay the, now the settings is saved let me just open one of the post from here so let me just go to post here and let me just open a post from here now let me just scroll down and as you can see there is the star rating schema like this so let me just give it four star or if i select one star and submit then it will ask you to give some feedback so let me just and it will as you can see it will ask you to give feedback so i can give this feedback to the author so that he can improve the post so let me just refresh this post again and i can i cannot give multiple votes in the same post so let me just 
open this in an incognito mode now let me just scroll down and let me just add an another rating here now let me just click on submit and it will ask you to follow you on social media like this so in this way you can add a star rating system in your wordpress website using this plugin and let's check some more settings in this plugin so i will click on rate my post here and let's click on customize and you can see different options like you can customize the leap empty or disable or different elements that we get in this plugin so you can read it and change it according to your choice and you can also change the font size and icon size like that and let's click on security here and you can give the permission to change the rating system you can only select it as admin and who can rate your post so i will keep it as everybody or if you are using any membership website then you can also select the login user here and you can also track ip address of your visitors and you can also block multiple rating with the same ip address so you can enable this and you can also track your users if you want now let's click on save settings now let's click on tools and you can also migrate the ratings from other plugins if you want and you can also delete plugins data also so that's it and you can add the rating system using this free plugin in your wordpress website now let's check a different plugin for the same purpose so let me just use this plugin kk star rating so let me just install this plugin first so i will go to wordpress dashboard and let me just go to the plugins first and let me just deactivate this plugin before that let me just copy this plugin and let's go to reach result task tool and let me just paste the url and let's test the url and let me just scroll down and as you can see the review snippet is already added and as you can see you will get the best rating and rating count and rating value so in this way you can also add the rating schema in your wordpress website through this plugin so by the way don't go for this because i have no index this website because i am using this website for testing purpose only so let me just go to plugins here and let me just deactivate this plugin now let's add the second plugin here kk star ratings so let me just copy this name here and i will search for this plugin so you can either use that plugin or you can use the kk star rating plugin so let me just install this now let me just activate this plugin now it will ask you to allow continue so let's skip this one now you can enable the status active or deactivate and you can also allow voting in archive is or not and you can select post pages archive pages or home pages so i will keep it as post and you can also select the different categories so it is asking to exclude certain categories so i will exclude on categorize post here now let's click on save now let's click on appearance here and you can also change the greetings like read this or you can change this number of stars and you can change the size and you can also change the position so let me just set it like bottom left or bottom center so let me just select bottom center here now let's click on save changes now let again go to post here and let me just refresh this page and as you can see you will see this option read this post so let me just give it as five star and as you can see the five star rating is added so this is a simple plugin if you want to just insert the star rating schema in your wordpress website then you can use this plugin and if you want to get more customization features then you can use the rate my post plugin and if you check in wp hive then it is passed all the um, testing in this wp hive test and let's check and i think this has impact on memory usage so that's that's why i recommend you to use this plugin rate my post for your star rating in wordpress so if you found this content helpful then make sure to hit the like button and if you have any feedback regarding this video or regarding our channel then you can ask me in the comment section i will see you in the next video thank you